Hey guys, it's been a while. I know I've been so bad about YouTubing, uh, mostly because I've been working like two jobs in one. <laughs> anyway, work's been crazy. That's all you need to know. I am happy to be here with you guys today. Uh, if you haven't already noticed, I have not worn this hair before, and that is because it is new. And this is Haley by John Renault, and she is part of their new professional collection, which is exclusively available at salons and like brick and mortar wig shops. And so I just wanted to do a quick little overview of Haley. And uh, they have tons of new styles. They also have some uh, re vamped, if you will, versions of some of their existing collection in European hair, which love the European hair. Um, it feels totally different than their typical smart lace human hair blend, which is still quality hair, but there's just something about that European hair that's just so soft. And so, like I said, this is Haley. The color is 22F. 16 S8 in the root, which I think really suits me um, because I'm a natural brunette. And so I need, if I'm gonna do a blonde, I need a blonde that's going to match my brows in the root area. And so she is a synthetic bob, super lightweight, super cute. I have not worn a bob in a while, guys. Um, Bobs were pretty much like my original wig choice because when I transitioned from wearing my bio hair to wearing wigs, my natural bio hair was cut in a bob. And I was so afraid to wear a wig in public that I went with something that was closest in style to what my natural hair looked like. So. Yeah, uh, I'm loving her. Her movement's really nice. She is fresh out of the box with one exception. So I took this bad boy, which is the John Renault steamer, and I just hit her right here a tiny, tiny bit because when I took her out of the box, she was doing a little curly Q thing, and I just wanted to calm it down just a little bit and so if you don't have that steamer guys you need one because um, especially if you're wearing synthetics you can kind of um, smooth out some of the little curls and things anyway okay so the fact that this collection is only available in wig shops kind of brought back some memories for me when I was in the process of researching hair and wearing hair I was completely alone I didn't have anybody to help me so what did I do I went online and I found this guy who sold wigs um, he was based in New York I don't even know if he's still in business but to make a long story short I spent $1,500 on a human hair wig that I thought was custom, but it turned out to be a stock piece and I wore it literally a handful of times and then I just stopped wearing it because the lace, it was like a full lace wig, the lace was really itchy on me. Um, I didn't know how to take care of it. I didn't have the proper like products and setup and everything and um, the top part at the crown like bunched up like I looked like I had a cone head and I just remember like picking I actually flew there to pick up the wig and because I have family in New Jersey and I went there picked up the wig he styled it for me it looked it looked nice when I left but then like once I got back to my cousin's house and like I looked in the mirror, just my heart sank because I felt like it was really wiggy, you know? Like, have you ever seen wigs that have like just a lot of like density, they look really thick up here. 
that's pretty much how it looked and to this day I regret that and part of the reason why I am so I don't want to toot my own horn but part of the reason why I'm so good at choosing wigs and knowing what works for me is because I have spent so much money choosing the wrong hair and so if there's anything that I can do for you guys if you're new to wearing hair that is to try to educate you and hopefully you know get you guys in a position where you're not wasting money and so that brings me to my point of if you have the ability to visit a brick and mortar wig shop where you can actually try on styles see the colors in person my advice to you is do it because you are going to feel like you have so much more information when you make that decision as to what kind of hair to buy. Uh, we all know that hair is not cheap. Uh, some of us have to save up for months to be able to buy one wig and um, you know we want to make sure that we're spending our dollars on product that's gonna make us feel comfortable and confident as opposed to something that's gonna make us feel self-conscious right because I felt self-conscious a lot when I started wearing hair and it's been a long journey I bought that wig maybe 10 years ago and I've been wearing wigs full-time for about six years so you can imagine like I held on to that wig I still have it by the way but um, I held on to that wig for like four years before I had the courage to like I ended up buying another like synthetic wig online that was a bob like, just like this but obviously not as nice and um, that was the first wig that I actually wore in public and so I'm gonna do I'm gonna pull my camera off of the tripod here and kind of show you where you can find reputable wig shops through the John Renault website and we can go from there um, side note how cool is this okay these are nano nano leaf yeah nano leaves and they actually respond to sound um, I don't think I have them set to respond to sound at this moment because I want them to look kind of glittery and pretty but anyway I just thought I'd show you that um, definitely a little splurge but I want to do more YouTube stuff and part of that means investing a little money in geeky things that make my background look cool <laughs> but anyways so on to the website guys I'm here on John Renault's website and guess who it is it's me I was trying to find my finger okay so what you're gonna do is navigate over here to find a store and click the little black dot and it's gonna bring up the map whoops enter a zip code I'm just gonna use the Atlanta zip code 30303 this is hard because I'm holding my phone okay and here's where I recommend you click core certified these are Retailers that have gone through John Renault's education program. It is an extensive program. Now, I don't think there's any within 10 miles, but if I expand it to 30, I get several here in the Atlanta area. And this is how you find the shops that carry the professional. Also, uh, you can go here and find international as well as online retailers but since we're having a discussion about going to an actual brick and mortar this is where you find them and once again this is the John Renault website which is johnrenault.com so there it is guys super easy to find a retailer if you can try to find one that's core certified um, so that you get uh, pretty much like the hand holding that I wish I had when I was looking for hair. Now this was a long time ago for me. Um, if you're new to wearing hair now or if you're still in a place where you're just not sure what to buy, I know that it can be so frustrating to go online, to look at reviews, you're not quite sure. Some of the pictures that people post um, in the reviews are like, just not good quality 
and then it, there's no feeling more disappointing than spending $300 on some new hair and the package comes in the mail and you open the box and you put it on and you're just like, no, this is not working for me. So I hope that this is helpful for you guys. My next video is going to be about how to avoid wig scamming websites. Anyway, guys, I hope this is helpful for you. Once again, this is Haley from the Professional Collection. She is a short bob. I'm going to go ahead and take her off so I can show you the cap. All right, so Haley is a monofilament lace front. She has an open wefted cap. That's the wefting. She's got the moleskin ear tabs. Um, just really light density, really nice movement. Super cute. Um, I would say, you know, if I had a wig like this, when I first started wearing hair, I would have been probably 10 times more confident than I was because I, uh, I remember that first day I wore a wig to work and I was dreading it. It's like, I have like PTSD from this. Okay. Anyway, if I had hair like this, when I first started wearing hair, I would have been so much more confident. And honestly, people probably wouldn't have asked me if you know something was wrong or if I had um, I had cancer or something but anyway yeah I'm really grateful that I don't know how to say this I'm really grateful that a company like John Renault cares enough about its customers to number one put out a high quality product but number two enlist the help of people like me to share educational content, to share personal anecdotes and stories that help you guys realize that you are not alone um, navigating the journey of wearing hair and hair loss can be really daunting, but I am here and so are the other ambassadors. We're here to help you, uh, to just make you feel um, like you're not alone, like you have a place to go to. Also, I do want to let you know that uh, there is a group on Facebook. It's called John Renault uh, Insiders. And this is for folks that wear John Renault's hair that just want to go in there and talk John Renault product. I think it's a great resource. Um, if you're not sure about what kind of hair to buy, you know, there are folks in there, John Renault staff, and then us ambassadors that can kind of point you in the right direction. I mean, guaranteed, you're probably going to have some hits, lots of hits, more hits, hopefully, than misses, but you are going to have some misses when it comes to hair, but if you can minimize that experience, then um, all the better, because uh, wigs don't grow on trees. So, anyway, guys, glad to talk to you, and I will see you soon. Bye.